that is breathing circuits. What are breathing circuits? Why do you need them? Breathing circuits are the components that help us deliver the anesthetic gas mixture to the patient. They can be classified as open systems, semi closed systems and closed circuit. The semi closed circuits were originally designed by Mapleson and they are further divided into type A, type B, type C, type D, type E and type F. The open systems were the original breathing systems where it all started with Schimmelbusch. who designed this Schimmelbusch mask to deliver ether and chloroform for anesthesia. Originally, they used to cover patients mouth and nose with cloth and the Schimmelbusch mask was placed on top and the ether or the chloroform was dropped from top. The vapors of the gas would seep in and the patient would get anesthetized when he breathes those anesthetic vapors. This is now outdated and no more used. Now, let us look at Mapleson circuits or the semi closed circuits. The design of these circuits is basic and they are still in use today. They have two tubings, one of which would bring the gas in, other one would take the gas out. So, the fresh gas will enter the fresh glass tubing through this inlet and it would go in and enter the patient through a face mask. Once the patient breathes and exhales the gas, it would go out and get collected in this outer corrugated tubing from where it will go to the outflow valve to get excreted. The outflow valve is an adjustable valve. You can adjust the pressure by rotating a knob. It is called as the APL valve. Also, there is provision of a reservoir bag that helps us deliver the fresh gases at a higher tidal volume. This reservoir bag is available in different sizes. For example, for a neonate, we use 250 ml bag. For a child, we may use 500 ml or a 1 liter bag and for an adult, we generally use a 2 liter bag or a 2000 ml bag. Let us now look at each of these circuits in detail. Mapleson classified these circuits from A to F based on the location of the pressure adjusting valve. In the circuits A, B and C, the valve is located near the patient end, whereas in the circuits D, E and F, the valve is located away from the patient. Each of these circuits have got an individual name. Type A is called as Magill circuit. Type C is called as water circuit. Type D is called as the Bain circuit. Type E is called as the ISTPs. Type F is called as the Jackson Rees circuit. As told earlier, the fresh gas enters from the fresh gas inlet and enters the patient through the face mask. So, in case of Magill circuit, when the patient is breathing spontaneously, the fresh gas flow is equal to the minute ventilation. Please remember Magill circuit is circuit of choice for 
spontaneous ventilation, but it cannot be used for controlled ventilation. Type B is similar to type A and it is no more in use, only difference between type A and type B is location of the fresh gas flow tubing. It is located closer in case of type B. The type C also called as a water circuit, the fresh gas flow is double the minute volume. It is also not in use anymore. The circuit that we commonly use is Bain circuit. Here the fresh gas flow is two and half times the minute volume when the patient is breathing spontaneously. It can be used for a patient who is breathing spontaneously. Also it is the circuit of choice for controlled ventilation. The fresh gas flow when it is controlled ventilation, it is 1.6 times the minute volume. ISTPs is a incomplete circuit as you can see there is no reservoir bag here. So, it is a incomplete circuit and we do not use it anymore. Whereas, the circuit that we commonly use is Jackson Reese circuit, it is a circuit of choice in case of pediatric patients. Both in type E and F, the fresh gas flow is again 2.5 times the minute volume similar to Bain circuit. So, that completes a discussion on Mapleson systems. These are semi closed circuits. What are the other types of semi closed circuits? They are Hafina and Humphrey. Humphrey ADE. Please remember we do not use these circuits that is why I am not discussing about these circuits. 